Hello my fellow aliens. <laughs> Welcome back to her channel. Oh, if you're new here, she's Jojo Rarity. So today my sister is gonna take over my channel. Just kidding. I asked her here because I'm gonna do Q&A video including mukbang. Yeah. And yeah, we're gonna eat. Why? Right? Yeah. I answer those questions you ask on my social media, for example, Instagram, YouTube or Facebook. And yeah, she's the one who's gonna ask the question, and I'm gonna be the one who's gonna answer them. So anyway, let's, let's get, get started. started. So by the way, my name is May, and I'm her sister. So I'm gonna show you what we're gonna eat today. Because yesterday we had a birthday celebration, so that's the leftover. Mm -hmm. Spaghetti and with sausages. And here's coleslaw. Gonna eat it as well. Yep. So, so. I'm gonna have a bite first. Then we'll look at the question. <laughs> okay. What's your favorite superhero movie and why? Um, it's definitely Captain America, The Winter Soldier, because I like the second part more. It's so good because obviously Chris Evans is one of my favorite actors. Always been, I know him even before Captain America. And Sebastian Stan I also know before he played Bucky. And that's why then he knew that he was alive. It was so cool to see that. Because they've been best friends and kind of being reunited, and so much action, also drama, and it's just really the best superhero movie for me. Yeah. So, what's three things you miss when you were in Italy? By the way, we were in the yeah. Philippines. We <laughs> lived there before, it was like four years ago now. And what I miss, I guess, the beach life. Because in Germany we don't have a lot of nice beaches. And of course my friends, because I made a lot of good friends. I miss them always. And I guess the food also. I miss the food. I like Filipino food. And for example, Jollibee. I miss to eat in Jollibee. Yeah. Okay. What What's your favorite color or... And what's the what's the favorite place you visited already visited? Uh, two questions. Yeah. The color and a place. The my favorite place I visited. Yeah. Favorite color is red. Always have been. And my favorite place I visited, I gotta say it's England. I've been to London. What year was it again? <laughs> 2017. 17 and yeah I always wanted to visit London for so, such a long time and to see the London Bridge and the London Eye and everything was so amazing and yeah this is my most favorite place for sure and one thing and also I must say I've been to France and Disneyland oh yeah this was the most enjoyable experience also and it's such a nice place what genre of music you prefer? Emo, punk, no metal, or all of the above? <laughs> should I just guess? And uh, should I just choose one of them? Or what's it again? <laughs> <laughs> favorite genre? Ah, favorite genre actually pop -punk. is pop punk. Yeah, if you know me, I'm a pop punk girl. I was an emo girl before. Before I loved emo, and now it's pop punk music. Yeah. I also like actually I have I like many kind of music, so. but that's the most I listen to. What makes you inspired to start vlogging? Vlogging? Yeah. Well, yeah. Actually, okay. I always love vlogging. I always done this before. I did this YouTube thing. Like for example, we always go to concerts together, and then we always like vlog it also. Just. Like, if you know me and if you follow my social media, you see that I always post like stories. So that, like, 
the hotels I've been in, the concerts I've been in, the place I've been in, I always posted before, just on stories. I never did make a vlog about it. It's kind of sad because I always wanted, I always like to do videos. It's always my thing, but I never do like fully vlog it the whole time. So yeah, now it's the time I can start to like vlog really everything I've been to, Comic Con, concerts and so on and travel if everything is gonna be fine. So, yeah. This is a long one. Okay. If you have if you have a time machine and give a chance to go back in previous life to change your mistake, if there is, what would it be and why? Hmm, okay. If there's time machine. <clears throat> it's like I don't want to change anything because it's like butterfly effect. If I change one thing, everything will change. But for example, if I wonder if it's gonna what my life's gonna be like if I hadn't left Germany. Uh, yeah, because all these ten years I've been in the Philippines. I just wonder maybe my life would be so different if I never left here. So maybe I would if I would change it and that I never visit Philippines or something. But I won't do it because I will never then meet you guys, my friends from there. So I can't regret anything because then I will never know these, these guys that means the most to me, that's why. But it's never a good idea to change the past, because you can't. You? Focus you on the, the future. If you know about the fact you know that if you change one thing, everything going to crumble. So better not to change anything. It's also similar. If you have a chance, what memories you want... <clears throat> want you... What memories want... You want to the English is wrong. What memories want you to bring... You want to bring back, and why? Oh god, there's so many memories I want to bring back. But I Your birth But I remember... Birthday, right? Yeah, I remember that. Who asked the question? I think this was like a birthday in... My last birthday in the Philippines it was so most memorable ever because... 2015. It was 2015, yeah. and most of my friends came. We had a big group. That was fun. And it was so fun because I never celebrated with such a big group before. And we did like... Enjoyed that much. We went like pub hopping mm, and yeah. like clubbing and, and this kind of things. <laughs> drink a lot and just had fun. And, my, and I always like that my friends, we meet friends. It's the most fun always. Actually, my friends did become friends also. So it's pretty cool. It's the most memorable mm. experience for sure. What's the best comedy movie you have ever seen? It's gonna be um, the Hangover, but only the first part is so or Wedding Crusher. Awesome. Or oh, Wedding Crusher, yeah, it's also so good. Actually, it's one of my favorite comedy movies. I really like to watch comedy movies because they're so fun, and I could watch <coughs> like many times. So, I definitely those two. So, what is one German food that would recommend everyone to try? And Germans like to eat potatoes, sausages, like the German sausage, Frankfurter. Frankfurters, and I don't know, it's schnitzel. Is that German eating? Yeah, schnitzel. Schnitzel, like French fries with schnitzel. I don't know if there's a word. It's like a the steak? Yeah. It's just like most. Or like, that would I recommend yeah. because, yeah, Frankfurters and schnitzel. <laughs> If I will invite you for a date, which place would you prefer? Beach, mountains, or just around the city? Wow, beach. For sure. I love beaches and so romantic. I think for the first date, it's pretty sweet. Or maybe, I don't know, maybe first date to be like city. The first date in beach, like, over. <laughs> so like maybe first city, like have a coffee or have lunch to get <laughs> together. And then like second date, maybe beach. Who knows? So... What's the best zombie movie ever made? Either one. It's gonna be 28 days later. It's like the best one ever. And plus, Ken Murphy is in it. He's like one of my favorite actors, also. I know it's like 28 days later, I started with my obsession with zombies actually. 
And also, also like Dawn of the Dead. Even though don't say or it's Dawn of the movie. Dead. Yeah, it's like affected ones. But still. As for me, it's like zombie movie. It's like one of my faves yeah. to know. If you will be a villain. <laughs> the villain yeah. If you be a villain in a movie, who would that be and why? Um, Good question. Right now, come to think of it, maybe Loki from Avengers. Because he was a great villain there. <laughs> he was so funny and. I like Loki and yeah. That's my answer. <laughs> where's your dream vacation and where's where do you see yourself retiring one day? In vacation, I actually always want to go to the States. I actually been there when I was younger, but, but so long time ago that I don't remember everything. So yeah, it's also my dream and. I wish to retire there, really, actually. It's always been my wish, and hope I can make it. Who knows what's gonna happen in the future. Okay, what's your favorite TV show of all time, and mm -hmm. why? <laughs> wow, great question. It's gotta be The Walking Dead. And why? Because I've been watching it since the beginning, and as mm -hmm. you know me, I'm a zombie. Fan. I'm really obsessed with zombies, that's why. Even though I know the latest season were not that good anymore, but from one to five, I think, those are pretty good seasons. Mm -hmm. Went downhill, but still, I always. I watch it. Season seven, I Yeah, since I watched. Mm -hmm. I rewatched it like so many times, like. Yeah. Well, Walking Dead and Once Upon a Time is like my second favorite, I think. Those are the two shows that I watched like so many times on repeat, so. One of the best zombie shows out there. Is it true that you're into hip hop before? Who was <laughs> your favorite rapper? Yeah. Yeah, I was really. I was into hip hop before. Some time ago. Before I got into this walk genre. And my favorite rapper before was like definitely. Actually, Eminem is still. He still, is still my still favorite like rapper, him. actually. But before I listened also to 50 Cent, The Game, Chingy, I also liked. But as Omarion, Lil Bow Wow. I mean, in the Little Philippines, Bow. I gave my friend like old hip hop CDs because I have a friend who's like into hip hop. <laughs> I was so excited I gave them all. I don't remember any more rappers, but yeah, it was my past. <laughs> don't talk about it. Oh. How difficult is it for you to be honest, even when your words will be really hurtful? Actually, if you know me, guys, it's not difficult at all because I'm an honest person. Actually, most Germans are honest. So if I'm hurt or if I feel I'm hurt by someone, I always tell them honestly in the face because that's who I am. And if you can accept me for being honest, I get it a lot that people hate me for being honest. Yeah. To my friends or my past. Because Filipinos are kind of sensitive. Yeah, Sorry. so if I say something that hurt, I'm only being honest doesn't mean anything against you. It's just, it's better to be honest than keep it all inside. For me, I can't keep it all inside. It's better to tell it honestly to your face. <clears throat> okay, what movie disappointed you? Hmm. Yeah, there's a lot one of one answer. I have, there's a lot of movies disappointed me, but the one I can think of was Fantastic Four. The new one, I mean. Oh, so bad. The remake one. Of it. it was so bad. I watched it in theater and I was like, hmm. Because I'm such a big fan of Fantastic Four before. That's how... Because of Chris Evans. Because of Chris Evans. <laughs> this, that's why he's my favorite actor because of that movie actually. And when I saw it on theater, I was like, oh my god. Like, the beginning was, it was so slow the whole time. Like, it's already middle of the movie, and I'm like, hmm, something else happening. Only in the end. There's no fun, yeah, like, there's no fun line or something. Like, only the Evans made the, food, made the movie before so funny with the lines, but yeah. this one, only the end was like trying so hard to make it funny, but it didn't successfully succeed. Succeeded? I don't know. Mm. Favorite album of the year so far? Okay, there haven't been that many albums out yet, but for sure it's gonna be all time now. This the album Wake Up Sunshine. It made like 2020 good. With the other things happening around this year, so yeah, it's definitely a good album. There's gonna be an album pretty soon, next year, next month. So I'm excited to hear it. If there's a country, if there's a country you you want to go, except America, where is it and why? And like visit, I think it's a question, right? I haven't been. Yeah, I've gone to answer because I've been to many other countries. 
Actually, also like I like to go to Japan. Oh yeah, it's so cool. I want to go to more Asian countries. I've only been to Singapore, Philippines, and also you other you countries like Ireland. Actually, wanted to go this year yeah. because it didn't work out. And Sadly. other plan maybe Spain. So many places I want to visit. Haven't been to yet. String. Ah, that's a good question. Is on Pepsi. I want this question. So Pepsi. Yeah, Pepsi. If you had the chance to have a superpower, why would it be and why would you become a hero or a villain? I gotta say villain. I just kidding. And no, it's my superpower. It's so cool to be visible. I know, I always like that. A or like... A visit, or like change... Yeah, change. Like mystique. Mystique. Or it's so best. cool to be like a different person every single day. You can choose and can get away with anything. Yeah, or like jump away. Right? So oh, cool too! Jump, uh, yeah, Actually, jump is, the jumper movie? If you know the movie, jump, so to cool. jump to places. It's so amazing because you can, you can travel go anywhere, anywhere without, without money. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Money. Yeah, True. but so many. But of course I would be a hero. I would do it I will do good things with when I have a power, of course. Duh, if you know me, I'm a good person. <laughs> but yeah. So that's it for guys. And there's so many more questions, it's like fifty or something more. Yeah. I'm sorry I didn't answer, maybe I can do another video if you want to see it, part two. Someday. Yeah. But anyway, hope you enjoy it. Anyway, I forgot to mention Thanks for my, all my subscribers that I reached 200 and now I have more than 200 and thank you guys so much <laughs> with drink in my hand and we also forgot to shout out to my high school classmate JJ Nankel <laughs> sorry I hope you pronounce it like that and yeah thanks also for the question so thanks again guys before I go please I just want to remind you please don't forget to subscribe, subscribe give a thumbs, thumbs up, and, and comment down below. below. So, see you guys next time. Bye! Bye.